last time on Zoo Tycoon. Oh, rats. That's the delete all photos button. I don't know, I am kind of wondering. Maybe I had a picture of something really cool that I just accidentally deleted. Oh well, I'll have to go back and look. And now here we are back again with more Zoo Tycoon 2. Uh, we're going to be playing the next campaign game, uh, which is in the, the next campaign. Prevent animal abuse. Always uh, good to prevent that sort of thing. And uh, we're going to be playing African Elephant Rescue. <clears throat> which is here in Eastern Europe. I don't know where that is. Uh, a group of African elephants was scheduled to be culled in the Kingdom of Surangia uh, because of elephant overpopulation. Instead, they have been offered to the zoo that creates the best and most suitable habitat for the animals. Complete all scenarios in this campaign to unlock the sundial statue. I'm looking forward to the sundial statue. I like a good sundial. So I guess... Sorangia. African elephants. Sorangia is not a real place on our earth. I guess it's one of those fictional countries like Kerplakistan from Austin Powers or Wakanda from the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Who knows? Oh well, I don't suppose it really matters. Let's go. I mean, an elephant is an elephant, no matter where it's from. What universe? Doesn't matter, you know? Uh, Alright, uh, let's see, we just uh, read that. Best and most suitable habitat for the animals. One crated African elephant has been delivered to your zoo and can be found near the front gate. Uh, create a wildlife exhibit for the elephant and ensure that its basic needs are met. If you can demonstrate your ability to care for this species, you will be given three more animals of mixed gender to help you establish a thriving community. All right, elephant herd edition. Okay, so this is our zoo. The Sirangia Zoo. So I wonder, is this Sirangia? in Eastern Europe? Is that a thing? We just have elephants running around in Eastern Europe? And that's a problem, I guess. I mean, I guess that would be a problem. This is a nice little zoo. I really like it. I especially... Here, let's get down on the ground. Ah, oh, look, there are people in it. I mean, I guess it would be a good zoo if people were in it. We've only got $10,000 to start with, but that's okay. I really like this wetlands exhibit. The, the nice... Press oh, we've got... Hippo, flamingos. Two hippos, at least. Maybe more. I'll check later. Hippos aren't mm, really what's necessary right now. And then, ah, trash. Ooh, let's check the staff situation. Um, staff. We've got two zookeepers, but no maintenance workers. And we know how I am about maintenance workers, so I'm going to go ahead and get one right now. Hi. Welcome to our zoo. I'm new also. Ooh, that's a kind of a long line at the ATM. I'll probably... Oh my goodness, look at this. I love these canopies. Or whatever you'd call it. Arch? Arch. Yes, it's an arch. <clears throat> wooden arch. And then this wooden slat fence. Oh, this is a nice kangaroo exhibit. I'm not sure. The wooden slat fence, it's a little... It might be a little too much... Look at it. It's swimming. It's stimulated. It likes its environment. Excellent. And uh, that's that's that. And we've got this nice little staff area here. That's um. Do we fix this? I feel like this is not meant to. Well, I guess in order to fix it, we'd have to delete the fence because the fence is like stuck that way. So let's. Uh, and we won't get this fence until... It doesn't say, but it's probably something absurd, like three stars. Anyway, and that's everything. Aha! New objects are now available for purchase. Is the wooden slat fence one of them? Ah, it is! Perfect! What about the wooden slat window fence? Nope. No, no, that's window fence. Oh, it's different. Wooden slant window fence works well in combination with non-windowed, providing both reasonably placed and... Well, suffice to say... 
I could actually fix this. Yeah, I think I'll do that. Why is there this big hill here? That looks really strange. I must say, I don't like it. So we're just gonna smooth... Well, yeah, we'll... It doesn't have to be perfect. And then... What? Oh, I have to research it. Well, that would have been... <clears throat> Good to know. I did not research it. Why oh, can't... Hello? There's something strange going on. Ah, oh, okay. Not sure what that was. Alright, uh, in the meantime... African Elephant 1... Female. So I'm thinking right over here would be nice. Uh, do we have... This path? Yes. Okay. So I think maybe like hmm. so there's so I'm thinking this forest area can just be converted into so we don't have access to the window fence so I can't just make this all windowed and put the elephant here. But what I might do is... Why... Alright, well, first we'll fix this while I'm thinking about it. And then staff gate. Alright, so here's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking maybe... Something like this. Alright, yeah, so let's, um... Like that. That'll nicely frame that little tree. And then... Yes, okay, so I think, yeah, so after we do that, um, oh yes, I really like how this is turning out, then I'm just going to have like a small, like this, and then it's going to connect back over here, um, is what I'm going to do, kind of, like, No, not like that. Maybe, maybe just like this. Yeah, that that'll that'll be fine. Uh, right. Excellent. Uh, oh, and then we're gonna need to uh, do something about this. Yes. So if I do that, then does that fix that? No, it does not. So, hmm. Maybe if I make it external like this, and then... Ta-da! Perfect. Okay, so now we're going to... Delete that fence. And delete these two, I suppose. Um, and then we're gonna use our flat or our uh, smooth terrain tool again. Smooth all this, especially over here. I mean, of course, it doesn't need to be perfectly flat. I don't have a time limit. Alright, uh, now, I like this low wooden slap fence here.
Ooh, well, actually... Actually, well, because I might want to have some guest amenities, facilities, some sort of stuff right here, so... Oh, well, you know what? Oh, rats. Okay. Uh, let's see what... So here's the elephant. Zookeeper recommendations for fences. There are none. Hmm. That's a little bit unfortunate. But nothing I can't handle. Nothing I... I uh, we'll just, um... We'll just use this wooden fence. I mean, as long as the elephants are happy, it's not going to be an issue. And then maybe later I'll upgrade it to a uh, windowed wooden slat fence or something. I mean, I understand, of course, the elephant is quite a large animal. Start with... Uncrate. Here we go. How are you doing? Needs more... More space. Um... You know, it's interesting you should say that, uh, because... Okay, space is satisfied. It's the biome that's pressing. Okay, that's fine. Uh, this is not the proper biome. This is an African... African elephant? African bush elephant? African forest elephant? I mean, I suppose they're pretty similar. I believe the African forest elephant is... small. Whereas this elephant... It's not small. This is an African bush elephant. It's also a little bit pink. You know, the whole pink elephant thing. Uh, oh, right. Okay, yes, 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 yes. Uh, Savannah, I'll just start. There we go. Perfect. Let's see. Do we have any savannah trees and grass? We do. Ooh! Okay, wait. Hang on. <clears throat> the Kingdom of Surangia. Oh, look, there's a space before the the. That's interesting. The Kingdom of Surangia is pleased to be able to offer you the remaining African elephants. The animals will be delivered to your zoo shortly. The habitat conditions will be monitored by the International Society of Animal Wellbeing. I saw. For the next three months, should you fail to meet these basic needs for any of these animals, they will be removed from your zoo and donated to another facility. Alright, well, that's. Tragic. We wouldn't want that. So, I'm going to really quickly... Uh... Finish. And then I think I'll also put some... Nah, no, that's not necessary. I'll just kind of, um... No, I don't like that either. Uh, let's, let's just sort of, nope. just kind of get that right. Now. Just, I gotta get it perfect. Nope. Maybe a little bit. Yes, that's better. There, this will be good. Uh, and then, uh, yes, I will give it some, her some water. Them, I suppose. Later, there's going to be multiple elements. Oh, and then that creates like a nice little bridge. Right where the savanna ends, which I definitely like, and then I'm gonna soften this part right here. And now, of course, my elephants need food, uh, so I'm gonna give them some branch, no grass. Uh, yeah, we'll do some hay, hay here, and some water. And since there are going to be multiple elephants, I'm going to give them multiple things of hay. I mean, four elephants is kind of a lot. They did say three more, plus the one I have. Ah, yes, that is a total of four. All right. One. Two. And... Three. 
All right. I saw officials are satisfied that your facility is capable of providing excellent care for your herd of African elephants. Your elephants sh are here to stay. And the ISAW will contact you again should they become aware of other animals requiring suitable homes. Excellent. Care for your animals and strive to meet all their needs. Their conditions will be evaluated in three months. Uh, yes. That's what I thought, is that they were going to be for three months. I don't know why it says they're here to stay, but the whole three-month thing is still a thing. Anyway, I'm going to wash them all real quick, just in case. Wash. Wash. Yes. Bubbly elephants. Wow. 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 Really quite an impressive uh, group of animals. Have some more hay. Thanks. <clears throat> they really are quite large animals. How will my guests feel? I have confidence in this wooden fence. I think so. Uh, in the meantime, I should put a staff gate. Staff gate. Go. Yes. I mean, there's already a staff gate over here, so another one over here will be fine. Uh, and there's also another staff gate here, which... But of course the guests won't be running around here, only the staff. Of course, the staff run around with the animals anyway. So that's not an issue. Oh my, they've already eaten so much hay. Uh, and I will want a donation box. Excellent. Juanita Graf, how do you feel about these animals? African elephant two seems pretty happy. Polar bear one is licking its paw. I mean, I guess that's old news, but I want to see polar bear one. Water, polar bear. Here we go. Oh right, so uh, so yeah, so I I, I accidentally deleted the, some pictures. I deleted them all. Actually, is what happened. Uh, and then I said, hopefully that uh, I didn't delete any good ones. But it turns out that I did delete some good ones. I deleted some baby pictures. Really, really cute baby pictures of a baby jaguar. And most importantly, tragically, I deleted some pictures of the tortoise trio. I remember Threet, Forte, and Five Eat. I had a cute, adorable picture of the three of them, and I accidentally deleted it. So then I walked out into the middle of the desert and screamed at the universe. And then I took a picture of that instead. Of course, that's not actually me. That's stunt double, you know, such as it is. Ah, uh, but, you know, these things, they happen. Well, I guess we'll just uh, wait here for three months then, I suppose. So I think I ought to give my uh, elephants some shelter. I'm going to give them this shade structure. Right... Right here, maybe? I mean, that does kind of create this weird indentation, but that's nothing I can't fix. Nothing I have to fix similar things in the past. There, I'm gonna flatten this out just a little bit so that it's easier to smooth. Now, what are their needs like? Oh, they need some of that. I'll give them some apples to begin with. And then I'll also research this holiday present with Apple. It's pretty cheap. I also think maybe it'd be nice if I gave them some friends. I mean, of course, there are four of them. But, you know, just to round out the exhibit, some Thompson's Gazelle will be nice. And I'll also give Thompson's Gazelle some more hay as well. There are six animals in this exhibit. Um, I don't think that's good behavior. Bashing your head against the wall, and then putting your head in the wall, that's... But, he seems to enjoy it, so... I suppose who am I to argue? Um, they're all 
herding over towards the shade structure. So I'm trying to think what to put, like over here, because it feels a little empty, and I'm wondering, should I maybe put like, some trees? trees? Mangrove tree, and put a wet one. We've already got food stands over here. Unfortunately, the only bathroom currently available to us is the small restroom. We still need two stars in order to get the large restroom. I could do something with this. No, I'm not sure that. That's fake. Dandelions. Hmm. Dandelions. Uh, but I think... I noticed there's no dessert carts over here. Oh, I have to research all of them? I mean, I could get a Tundra one, but that wouldn't really fit with cotton candy or popcorn. Oh, or pretzels. Pretzels. Pretzels are a classic elephant-related snack. No. I mean, I guess those are peanuts, actually, not pretzels. They're very confusing. They both start with the same letter. And I wouldn't know. Did I put the pretzel card? Yes, I did. Okay, good. Hippopotamus 1 is now pregnant. That's cool. And Greater Flamingo 3 is going to lay an egg. Excellent. We have some more baby animals. There it is. There's the flamingo egg. I don't know. I'm going to take a picture of it. Doesn't matter much. Jump it. Jump it. What I would really like is for my elephants to breed. Baby elephants. Among the cutest baby animals. Huh. Although my guests, they really are complaining about the lack of restrooms, so I think I'll just go ahead and give them some new restrooms now, rather than wait. That one will be good there. And then I can delete it once the large restroom becomes available. Hold on there. Maybe... Hmm. I mean, this one, of course, I will place, but... Yeah, I think that should, um, that should do it. You know, it occurs to me that maybe I should put the bathroom... I mean, it's it's right there. Mm, that's not too far. But it occurs to me that perhaps I should put the bathroom right where the food is, you know? So, you eat, and then you have to use the bathroom. The question is, which side should I put it on? I put it on this side. Like this. Also, this is a very interesting path design. Quite sure. I mean, but over here, there's, you know, see here, there's an extra table, but here there's not. So, like, put it like here, and then that would like balance it out. But then it's already kind of balanced out. So I think I will put it over here. That's like, you know, with the interesting path. Oh, like here. Hmm. Yes, I think it. It should be right there. That's good. Oh, do I have... No, the compost building does not become available until two stars. So look, look, I just put a bathroom right there. For you specifically, Azim Trimpy. Wow. He's unhappy. How are my elephants doing? <gasps> look at them, they're... Ah, finally, the research of the holiday present app is... Finally complete. Cost two hundred eighty dollars for a box with an apple in it. It's fine. I'm not complaining. Look, they're all swarming towards it. Small ungulate poop. Oh, there they are. What? What is this? Ridge. Ah. Who did that? I guess eventually it breaks open, and then they get to eat the apple inside. Very nice, classic. Wash after all. You 
can also get these with um, meat for carnivores. Later. I mean, well, actually, I don't know. Here's a carnivore. Uh huh, I could get the holiday present with beef for my polar bear, but I think I'll just get regular beef. And I'll go check out Greater Flamingo, Baby Flamingo. I mean, it's not like we've never seen a baby flamingo before, of course we have, but it's still pretty cute. Kangaroo 3 is now pregnant. What's the gender dynamic of my kangaroo exhibit? Looks like we've got... And they're really easy to tell. So, you know, the males are this bright red-orange. So it looks like then we've got three females, one male. I do actually like this bridge. It's kind of nice. I mean, it's a little uh, rocky. A little rock jagged. But I do kind of like it. Let's see, here we have one of our kangaroos. Red kangaroo 3. Sleeping on top of it. It's very cute. Ah, uh, she's happy. Excellent. Are you talking to me, Charlie? I talk to people by batting my tail on the ground. What is the gender dynamic of my elephant exhibit? I never did check, but I meant to. These ones aren't quite so easy to tell. We've got female, female, male, female. So again, three females, one male. I mean, I guess, you know, for uh, breeding elephant purposes, I suppose that's taking a bath. Ah, wait, 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 I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. I wasn't commenting on your bath. I was just... Just hiding. Red Kangaroo 3 has now given birth, baby kangaroo. Joey, as they say. Down, under, I guess. I, mean, I would know. Ah! Almost trampled female, but it still has that red color. I don't know if that's accurate or what. But she is cute. My kangaroo's hopping around. guest. African Elephant 1 is now pregnant! Oh, what? Hmm? I saw officials are satisfied that your facility is capable of providing excellent care for your herd of African elephants. Your elephants are here to stay, and the I saw... I saw that. We'll contact you again should they become aware of other... Wait a minute. Didn't we read, read this already? Hmm. Continue playing the scenario. No, don't play the next one. Continue playing this one. I want to see my baby elephant. I must. I must see it. I must see the baby elephant. Also, for my hippos. <gasps> see, there it is. Baby hippo. Hippopotamus 3. Nursing from Hippopotamus 1. Those are strange animals. They're so round and tubby, and they've got these huge mouths. I'm not sure. Anyway, I also, I've been experimenting a lot with this area right here, and I feel like this is what I want. You know, I, I you know, at first it was like, and then it was like, but now I feel like this is the way to do it. However, I just researched this elephant fountain, which I think is perfect for this zoo. So I'm actually going to put that, and then, then I'll wait for my baby elephant, and then we'll be done with this zoo, and then go on to the next zoo, you know, which is, uh, whatever the next zoo is. I'm not entirely sure, but such as it is, you know. Alright, so I think I'm going to put it, uh, I think I'll put it right here. Now the question is, should I put path around it? The answer, of course, is yes. I will do that. Nope. Like, that'll work. That'll be fine. And then something. No, can I just go? 
Oh, okay. So, so that's that's how it's gonna be. That's fine. I can I can live with that. Right. Is that all of it? Underneath? I think it is. And then let's. Uh, and then you know we do things we must. And let's delete. Um, I don't know what that is, but it's terrible. I don't like it. That's better. And then we'll just delete this fence here. See that? That looks nice. I like this. Perfect. Now it's perfect. Alright, here we go. It's been a long time waiting. Months. But African Elephant 1 is finally going to give birth. We're going to have a baby elephant. So, here we go. Oh, also I changed the fence. There have been several changes over the past few months. I replaced the pretzel stand with a popcorn stand. Five. That is definitely oh. Want to do the do the trunk thing again? No. Oh well. With a little trunk wag. Alright, I'm trying to turn away from it. That's fair. What is it? It's a girl. And. We got a balloon bouquet. For our baby elephant. I'm gonna put it over here by the statue. Yep. Alright, I'm gonna go with my baby elephant just a little bit more. Ha, huh, red kangaroo mane. Oh my goodness. The kangaroos have been breeding immensely. The elephant? Just this one. There we go. That's... That's the keeper right there. Polar bear. Polar bear one. African elephant five. Mm. Mm, black bar. These things are happening. Oh, and Greater Flingo 3 has died of old age. Tragedy. Ah, Red Kangaroo 8 has given birth. That's what, like 11 Red Kangaroos? 11 Red Kangaroos, yep. And one baby African elephant. Alright, well, uh, that, uh, that pretty much wraps it up for now. But, um... Adios, I guess.